Okay, come in today to do a quick read because my phone um, battery is low. So, we'll just see what we got going on for the current person that we are dealing with, okay? Like, actually in communication with, talking to, like, the person we're dating, talking to, whatever. Let's see. Let's, we're going to get an energy of what the fuck is going on with this situation, okay? If you'd like to book a reading with me, all that information will be down below in my description box, okay? So, first card out, we have retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world, okay? It's two people in this photo, but this could be a situation to where you just need to disconnect on your own, or y'all probably do need some private time together, okay? Then we have codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. Trust, this situation is calling for you to have faith. I love yourself first your self respect makes you more romantically attractive for yourself it's time to take back control of your life and then we have at the bottom children your love life is being affected by children okay so and then under children was new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. So, uh, I feel like, I mean, with the trust card here, it's a sense of just like, just, just having that faith, okay? But don't trap yourself mentally within the situation. Um... Mm. <laughs> that's all i'm really getting for him right now okay let me see some more let's see if we can get some more in depth <sighs> okay so then we have wife okay that kind of makes the re retreat card we have wife yes what the fuck no hmm truth Paid masculine, and at the bottom of the deck, we have side nigga. Okay, and then under that, we have nice boobs. So, somebody feels like you got some nice boobies here, okay? Um, it's still not even giving me nothing, okay? But I feel like, okay, this person might have some issues. So, we got a paid masculine here, and then we got a side nigga. So, somebody got a side nigga, okay? And I feel like somebody knows about that shit or some kind of person on the side that like you know you kind of just kick it with or something some shit like that okay but i feel like that could be causing a rift in the situation okay but not really okay let me see here Ooh. it's yeah it's kind of like it is but it ain't you know like yeah. Okay, let's see. But we got wife out here. So this person looks at you as their wife. And you can either look at this person like they got it all together. They not all the way emperor status, but they got it all together. You know, it's some shit like that. Okay, so then we have four wands. Yeah, so the, they look at you as marriage material, okay? Four, this is the stability. This is the 11-11 card. So some of y'all could be dealing with a twin fame or just a soulmate, though. But this is like, this is celebration. This is good times, though, okay? But with the four wands here and the wife card, this person looks at you as their wife, okay? So if you got some other shit going on, they thinking that they a side nigga. Okay, then we got some ace of ones. Yeah, they thinking that you got some new dick. They thinking that you doing some moshi. You got a new person going on. But the ace of ace of ones here is kind of like this is their new spark. Okay, so it's either a new spark about you or a new spark in this situation. But they feel like okay, look, if you got another 
the ones, this ace of wands does represent a male phallic, okay? Could be a pregnancy involved with the children here, but it's kind of like, okay, look, if you got some new dick around, four of wands and ace of wands, that's five of wands, that's conflict, okay? That's jealousy. This person could be a little jealous. Not really, but really, okay? Then we got the father of pentacles here. So this person feels very protective of you, okay? They are financially stable. This is also an entrepreneur, okay? This person does see the whole shebang with you, okay? Could be dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, or fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sag. But this person is very protective over you. They want to be able to provide for you. They want to be able to give for you. Like, they want to be the it for you okay and we have the eight of swords they're all mentally stuck trapped in their fucking head about some shit okay and then we have the chariot card here the chariot card is success that is being triumphant okay and that is coming towards something fast okay with that chariot card here but it's like they're coming towards you fast i feel like now it's kind of like they need that it's like they know that they like need to get on it okay at the bottom of the deck is the nine of wands so this is the wounded warrior card they're fighting okay they are holding on they are wounded though but i feel like they are still holding on and they could be very much guarded okay six of cups at the bottom of the deck it could definitely have to do something with children here or kids okay but the six of cups that's past life situation that's um or just something from the past or new and this person have history okay and and that could just be what it is okay so let's see what is clarifying this four of ones but this person i feel like this person does want to be with you it's just it it's some issues here it, it is okay and they could be wounded from something that you know happened from them in a past situation or a past life situation, okay, that they're really, really the now now, or they just got some inner childhood wounds that has them very guarded, okay, especially when it comes to other men, okay, what is the four of wands? And the father of pentacles, that is the paid masculine, okay, so this person do got money. Not that that matters, but they will be able to be stable, okay, I'll say that. They will be able to be stable. What's the four of wands? Okay, and with the four of wands, we have the page of wands. That's what I'm saying. This person sees you in their future, okay? It's an immature energy because it's coming off as a page, okay? And the, the pages do represent children, okay? So, it's kind of like with the page of wands, it's kind of like, um, they do take you serious. They do. But, it's just, they are coming towards you as well, but it's kind of like, this person, when they take action, it might be immature, okay? So, it's kind of like what, what you might expect might not be what it is that they are able to give. But they do see you in their future, okay? This is messages coming in. So, you might receive a message that this person does, like, want to be with you, okay? Under the bottom of the deck, we have the emperor card here. <laughs> So, it's a lot of males around you coming at you, okay? Uh, that's probably why I feel like this person feels like they need to get it going because they know a lot of people coming at you, okay? But the four ones is out here in the emperor card here. Some of y'all could definitely be dealing with y'all's divine masculine, okay? He could be going through some another level of some kind of awakening, like, to, to get the shit fucking going, okay? That's what I feel like. To get the shit fucking going, okay? This person is definitely a father, okay? They definitely do have kids, okay? So, what is this Ace of Wands here? And they definitely do see them being the father to your children. What is the Ace of Wands? What's the Ace of Wands? The Ace of Wands, we have the World card here, okay? Major Arcana, okay? This is cycles closing out, but endings for new beginnings, okay? So, um, this, this ending, I feel like this ending of a situation could have been something with a kid. It started a new cycle, okay? But after the World card comes the Fool, and that's the first card of the Tarot deck. That's you taking a risk on to doing something, okay? So, it's kind of like... 
a, a cycle has wrapped up. Okay, there has been a completion of a cycle, especially when it can when it comes to ones that's passion, that's like communication. It's been a cycle of that. It's been a wrapping up of that. Okay, and I think when it comes to dealing with you know ace of wands that new beginning that new creative spark it's kind of like that's staying here you know and it was kind of and i feel like there is no new person coming in like i feel like you feel like this person is the person okay but i feel like this person doesn't feel like they're the person okay it could be some travel here okay with the six of wands um the, the i mean six of swords the six of swords is moving from a rough situation to a better one okay so i feel like this person or it could be this person because it's masculine. I feel like this masculine is moving mentally from a tough situation onto a smoother one, okay, with this rainbow here. It's kind of like going towards something. You know what I mean? Like, or leaving one situation to go to another. This person could feel like you're leaving one situation to go to another. Yeah, with five of pentacles out there. It's kind of like left that in the cold, five of pentacles, you know. Or, or they feel like if you left them to go with to somebody else, it's kind of like cockiness here. It's kind of like they going to feel like, okay, you might leave, but you won't be left out in the cold. And please, we all know that ain't motherfucking true, okay. We got the emperor out here and the father of cups. I mean, the father of pentacles. Either way, they both bosses. They both entrepreneurs. It's just one is a little bit more than the other. So, either way, feminines, we're going to be good. This masculine's a fool, obviously. But whatever. That emperor card coming out here with this page of wands, this fiery, like, he's passionate. He is. He's fiery. The emperor card wants to be in control, wants to have some kind of structure and something, okay? I feel like this person has ways that they do shit, okay? And it's kind of like... You know, I mean, come on, we free, um, divine feminines, okay? But with this world card and the six of swords and the chariot, I definitely do see, um, I definitely do see here travel, okay? So maybe there's like some distance between y'all, okay? But this rain, I feel like this person wants to go, I feel like this person, if, okay, this is the direction, this person doesn't just want to be a baby dad, okay? I feel like this person wants to move from just being, because the emperor card is a father, okay? But I feel like this person wants, and he's the king of all the kings, but I feel like this person doesn't just want to be that. I feel like this person wants the whole shebang. So it's kind of like, um, don't just put me in the cat, like, I don't know. Don't you, yeah, don't just put me in the category of just a baby father. Like, that's what I'm not. Like, I'm more than that type of thing, okay? I don't know why this person thinks that, but that's what this person is thinking. But they could be coming out of this thought process, though, okay? What is the Father of Pentacles? Three. And with the Father... My battery is going down fast, okay? With the Father of Pentacles, they have the Ten of Wands. Yeah, so we have the Nine of Wands out here with the, the Ten of Wands. This is somebody releasing a burden. This is somebody, like, you know... So this is the type of person that can handle it. They can handle a heavy load, and they also know when to let a heavy load go, okay? But they only got to be in emperor status or even father of pinnacle status from them being able to carry that heavy load, okay? And then we have the ace of cups out here. So we have two cups, aces, aces here, okay? But I feel like now this person is getting to the point to where they are able to release these burdens because they have that self-love there, okay? With this ace of cups here and that new love, it's kind of like this person could be thinking that you have a new love, okay? But it's kind of, or this person could be just wanting to bring this new love to you okay yeah with this father cups at the bottom of the deck it's kind of like they have a lot of emotion they do definitely if they seeing you as a wife they love you a lot and with this ace of wands and this ace of cups it's kind of like they want to start over you know what i mean like they they do want to start over okay what is this ace of swords here what is this ace of swords here what are they mentally trapped about ace of swords What is this Eight of Swords here? What is this Eight of Swords? And this Eight of Swords, there it goes, Eight of Cups. So they are mentally trapped in their head about their feelings for you. It's kind of like, do I show them feelings or do I not? You know, but this Father of Cups here, we have a lot of male energy out here. So this person mainly is just thinking about all the dudes around you, okay? But it's kind of like, do you even see that I want to be with you, you know? So, um, 
someone they could be feeling like you know you're dealing with somebody from your past or like maybe you and your past are getting together okay but i feel like there's a sense here that they want some with a judgment card here for one they they know that they need to make a judgment call on the situation okay and i do feel like yeah with the decision they do i feel like they feel like you need to make a decision, but I feel like in reality, it's them that needs to make a decision. But yeah, it is love here, okay? It is, for sure. It is love here, okay? And I feel like with the judgment card here, there's a sense of like needing to forgive themselves or to forgive you, okay? But they are mentally trapped about a situation. And it's it's a mental entrapment, okay? But it's like they feelings are wrapped in it, okay? What is the chariot card here? What is the chariot card here? And with the chariot card here, we have the daughter of cups, okay? So that'll be like you fucking with them a little bit. You know, you this is kinda like the page of cups. So the page of cups is a love message, love offer. You know what I'm saying? It's kinda like they are waiting for you to express something to them. Or they are waiting for you to even to apologize to them. Okay? They feel like you might be sneaky or deceptive, okay? And I feel like you feel like you... The Seven of Swords is a sneaky, like, energy, okay? The Seven of Swords is something sneaky going on. But with the whole bunch of masculines out here, then you might be up to some sneaky shit. But I don't feel like it's wrong, okay? I feel like this person is just paying attention here, though, okay? This person is watching you for facts, okay? You are all they think about. You probably all they motherfucking talk about, okay? But it's kind of like they, this is, they want to come towards you, but they watching you. They want to know what it is that you fucking doing, okay? And then we got two pages out here, so that's two kids, okay? It could be a little boy and a little girl, okay? But it's kind of like with the page of ones, they see you in their future. And with the daughter of cups, it's kind of like you see them. You 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 can too, but it's kind of like you got to let me know what's up. That's what I feel like with the feminine energy here. What is the nine of ones? And with the nine of ones, we have the nine of ones. We have the five of ones. There it goes, that conflict, that um conflict in the workplace and on the ones they're very guarded about some conflict about some chatter about some competition here about some secret it's like they're very conflicted about what it is that you fucking doing but that's why they guard it they still holding on though and they putting up a fight so i feel like behind closed doors what you don't know they probably be defending you and shit okay um yeah under that we had the ten of pentacles they know and they could definitely definitely I already know what this situation what situation is to me. Okay, so I feel like if you are dealing with somebody and you know people that's around them, like you know people that cool with and shit, people around them have shit to say about you, okay? And I feel like it got your person looking at you. It's, it don't got them changing on how the fuck they feel about you. Yeah, and the nice booze we have stalking. It don't got them changing how they feel about you. It's just... It got them watching, okay? But with the Ten of Pentacles here, they want to be with you, okay? Yeah, it's just some hate. Devil card at the bottom of the day. It's just some hate here, okay? But, I mean, come on now. Like, if this is your divine masculine finna come into union, that's what it's gonna be. You know, the devil gonna try to stop some shit. It's gonna be some hate. It's gonna be some motherfucking problems. It's gonna be jealousy. It's gonna be conflict at the work field, you know? Especially if this person talk about you at work or whatever it is they do at work, you know? Like, if they got all this good shit to say about you, somebody finna have have some shit to motherfucking say and i feel like that's what's going on right now okay but let me see what is this five of ones give me this for this five of ones what is this five of ones what is this five of ones and then i'm gonna close it out because my phone probably gonna die but this is the quickest period i never did shit what is this five of ones please Mm-hmm, some bullshit. It's, it's some he say, she say shit, okay? And barely even some he say, she say shit. 
And with this five of wands here, we had an eight of pentacles. Yes. Yeah, so this is some are you this is some are you and some shit about a work situation. Okay. Or is yeah, higher level of commitment here. They want to be with you. Okay. I feel like people that they work with or people that they cool with, let's like them to them, got a problem with you. Okay. And it could be jealousy. It definitely could be jealousy, like why him and not me type shit, okay. Yeah, okay, but I feel like overall, this person want to be with you. What's under this new love card? And release your ex. Yeah, so I feel like this person is just wanting you to be just to them, okay? They want you to just be to them, and I feel like you are, but you need to express what it is that you want, okay? But this Eight of Pentacles, that's skill work, that's work, that is self, okay? That is somebody being focused in on their motherfucking money. I feel like this person feel like, okay, I'm all about you and my money, but what the fuck is you about? You know, like, what the fuck is you about, okay? But I feel like you've always expressed the truth to them, okay? But I feel like this person wants to go more in depth okay the six of pentacles to me is like getting facts okay i feel like this person is sniffing them out okay and he ain't doing nothing but running back to his motherfucking friends who i mean come on now if you the divine feminine yeah they want to be with you too look we got the father of pentacles the mother of pentacles out here so it's somebody in the group that wanted to be with you too okay but you took a risk onto this other person father of swords where you both of y'all thinking the same like i thought it's just somebody in the group that want to be with you too and it's like it wasn't them it was the person that you're dealing with so you could know somebody around the same circle of who you're dealing with and that person is jealous of you and your person's relationship so they're causing conflict okay so it's kind of like you are up against how many i mean god judgment card here in the heart is here so you are protected okay but you are up against one two three it's three against one come on now like but I feel like with the five here, that's all about to change, okay? This person has released a burden. So, I feel like this person ain't really listening to quite a few of them. He might still listen to a couple of them that he really fuck with. But the other ones that he fuck with, is kind of just like in one year after the other. But it still went in. It, it, it still went in, you know what I'm saying? So, it's kind of just like... You just gonna have to put up a fight. See, you might be the one that's have to put up a fight with those five ones, kind of ones. You might be the one that's have to be guarded, okay? But this, or this person know that, like, I thought this person is coming to the realization that, oh, shit, you eat type shit. So it's kind of like, okay, I know that I need to stand. I know that I'm gonna have to be strong because I'm fucking with a badass bitch, okay? It's like I'm fucking with a badass bitch. After New Love, we have release your ex and separation, okay? So it's kind of like this person, and this person know, like, they know it's just this person got problems this person got problems within the family within the home within their friends and it's kind of like i want to bring you in but it's a lot of shit going on and if i do bring you in is that gonna fuck some shit up or is it gonna bring some shit to fucking together okay on a nice boobs stalking we have no sorry 50 50 you know so it's kind of like I feel like this person might even think you might be fucking with one of these people. And that's when you come in and you like, no, it ain't that. It might have been somebody else, but it ain't that. You know? So, I feel like that's what the reading is today. This person is very confused about what it is, okay? I feel like they not listen to their intuition. We got the father comes out here. That's something they being very intuitive, okay? It's like their heart is telling them just to fucking do it, but their mind got them thinking about some negative shit probably about some past shit probably about what everybody got to say about your ass and it's just like whatever but the end the higher front is at the top of the deck and then right behind that shit would be you expressing how you feel okay i feel like you just need to go ahead and express how you feel you know let this person know what's up the six of pentacles let them know that it is growth here it is stability here okay you know but it's not no equal given it's not no if I'm not giving what I get emotionally, I'm only giving that to you. You know, like now on some other shit, like smoke, some smoking time, kicking and shit. Yeah, I might kick with motherfuckers, but on the emotional level, I'm only fucking giving that to you. You know what I mean? So I feel like you know, but God, the higher fun and judgment is out here. It's gonna all work out, okay? That's why it's having a reason for you to have faith. Don't even feed into the arguments and shit. It's just this person is mentally fucked okay this person is mentally fucked okay and it's at an eight so that's something that i feel like this is just gonna be happening this person gonna steady be worrying about you fucking with other people like that's just gonna 
be there but eight is also a card of abundance okay that's infinite okay so this is something that's here to motherfucking say but it's just like shit i mean i'm cute what can you say about that i'm cute i mean i don't know what else to motherfucking tell you like this person feeling like shit they decide they they don't even know that they the main nigga that's the crazy part but that's the reading i hope you guys liked it